Hi, I'm Matt Hill. I'm the conservation specialist here at MFA Incorporated. And I want to talk to you real quick about uh, some opportunities for drought assistance uh, relief or kind of mitigation. Uh, here in 2018, we've experienced some severe drought conditions in, in a big part of Missouri, uh, primarily you know, central, north central, northwest Missouri, uh, but unfortunately it's expanding. Um, I'm the liaison to a lot of uh, government agencies and organizations here for the company. And uh, th these, uh, as such as FSA, NRCS, Missouri Department of Natural Resources, and those folks are working to provide programs and assistance to primarily livestock producers that need uh, water resources or forage. So um, I'll just kind of go through the list. Now, to learn more about these, there's links below. Uh, and also you can visit your local county office and they'll be able to give you the sp specific information of what's available for your operation in your county. Uh, the Farm Service Agency has done several things. In, in many counties where the drought's the most severe and water resources are limited, they offer cost share to establish either permanent or temporary water sources for livestock production. They also have released CRP uh, for emergency paying and grazing in many counties where forage is limited. The Missouri Department of Natural Resources uh, Soil and Water District Commission has uh, offered a variance to allow grazing on their easement acres that are enrolled in conservation practices. That those normally aren't open, but they saw the, the limitation of forage and wanted to be sure that cattlemen had that opportunity. In, the NRCS most recently, just this week, um, did something that's fairly unprecedented, but they really saw the need for uh, forage in Missouri in the drought affected areas. So um, what they've done is they have uh, developed an equip program that is for forage development. So they're looking at, at planting annual cover crop type species uh, where they can be drilled in either dormant pasture, dormant hay fields, or uh, harvested crop fields to provide additional forage to your operation in, in this fall and winter. Uh, so they streamline the process. Any county that is designated as severe drought or also known as D3 on the National Drought Monitor, uh, those counties are all, the producers in those counties are all eligible. So just go to your NRCS office, sign up, they'll tell you what you need to do. Um, and then the other part of my job has been to make sure having programs is great, but if you can't find the supplies necessary to implement those practices, then they still don't do any good. So I've uh, been working with our seed division, the farm supply division, uh, feed division, and really everybody here, the agronomy division, to make sure that we have the supplies and the expertise necessary to help you supply uh, those needs on your operation so you can get these practices implemented and make sure that you can make it through this drought time on your operation.